Hey guys, today we got something special. See that? This is a contact. It's a. I will show you. It's a gold contact. See that? It's a gold contact. From the fingerboard, from the old Radgen device, you got contact, gold contact here, and on other side, and this is the copper with the gold plated here and here. So what we're gonna do? We will first remove that gold contact and. Put them on the that box. Then we're gonna remove that silver plated part, uh, gold plated part. Remove with the pins, and this is what is what we left. This is only copper, nothing else. So this is a waste. And uh, we got. Gold contact and uh, same like the gold pins. See that layer here. And we need to take off all of that. Take all the gold and uh, we'll process that with the force mana corrigia. Okay. And I forgot to say we got uh, 300 gram of these. 300 gram. Okay. Hey okay, guys, we remove all that contact. Here in that beaker, we got a 20 gram contact, but not pure. We got a lot of copper. See that? And from other side, we got here. This is gold plated. Other side of contact, but uh, we don't process that today because. Uh, it's uh, just a flash, flash plated. I don't know if you could see. Low, low grade, low grade plated. So just a flash plated and uh, it's look a lot, but it's not much gold here. Trust me. Today we will process only contact and this is what we got at the end. See that? This is every copper. So what I'm gonna do, I will burn that plastic and I will keep that copper. It's a free copper, isn't it? So I got uh, 200 milliliter HCl inside, and now I will do a process that with the Porzmana Corrigia. Just one spoon for the start. Somebody will probably say to me, why pores man, why not nit nitric? Because uh, I want to try. I don't want to use conventional method. So what should be happen here is that put some heat on. Uh, for the start, uh, Porzman Aquaridia will uh, supposed to remove all the base metal first, then gold at the end. Uh, contact is not pure gold, contact is uh, silver with the gold, probably silver. And uh, so, dead copper should be removed first, and uh, silver and gold should be left for the end. Okay? Hey guys, just want to show you. The first tour is done. Look at that. Only silver, only gold contact is left. And uh, I already test solution for gold, no gold. So this is the waste solution. We will decan this and uh, add a new one to dissolve gold. Okay, see that? Only gold is left.
just a little bit copper, not much, with decent solution, and now we will add a new batch to dissolve that gold in aqua regia, okay? So guys, we just to start, we got a lot of gold for dissolve, you see that? See that bubbles? But we got a, a very positive stainless test. Great. Okay guys, after the process is finished, look what is left. It remains on silver. And this is our, our solution. And this is only silver. So we just for a case, once again, do some aquaregia here. Then we drop some gold from here. Okay. We we'll drop some gold from contact. Looking good. Okay, but we got a lot of silver chloride inside. But now I. Okay, guys, after one hour, you see that major problem is my mistake. I'm not left the silver chloride settle down, but uh, solution is be very clear and. Uh, clear and uh, it don't look that got a lot of silver chloride but never mind see that the deposit on bottom this is gold mixed with the silver chloride so when this just settled down I will run to the nitric acid nitric acid and uh, remove that silver and leave on the gold okay guys no matter that silver chloride I start to filter all the solution and look at this it's a lot of gold but not pure gold it's a uh, with a silver chloride from that contact but uh, stenius test is be a very very strong so maybe maybe we got some bigger amount of gold we will see that okay hey guys remember that Gold contact, so uh, I will straight I straight melt, but I'm not melt good because uh, see that we got some dust here, not not so not very good because I'm lower with the gas on my torch, but never mind. Uh, this is from the silver contact uh, gold contact and uh, I go to straight melt I don't remove that silver chloride so this is 1.6 uh, when we remove all that borax maybe 1.5 gram the third line up to my finger this is that two last up to my finger is a uh, 14 carat so not bad that silver chloride is not uh, harm too much I don't need to go to extra fine because uh, I sell in my gold Fourteen carats, so I will do very fine. All that at the end. This is my today's score. This I got that little bit, two gram. 
and this little bead see that this is 23 uh, 20 uh, up to 22 carat and this is 14 carat you see the different this contain copper and uh, if you see very good this contains silver it's little white and shiny this is uh, like a matte color it's a uh, pure and this is 14 carat so so different okay guys that is it see you around I love testing gold see you around guys to the next video